What is going on, everybody? There is no time for an intro. There is breaking news. <laughs> Apparently, OpenSea has been hacked. Dan has been diving deep, trying to figure out what's going on. He's going to bring some more details for us, but this is urgent and a must-see for right now. Dan, what is going down with OpenSea smart contract? Mate, I was hitting a text message thread up straight away. Um, unfortunately, I'm in some discords that are pretty high level and will give you alerts straight away going, hey, there's security compromisation or um, something isn't the way it should be. And that's what happened this morning um, when the first thing was saying that OpenSea's new contract has been hacked. And of course, you're going to think that when something weird happens on a new contract, you're going to go, hey, this is sus. Um, let's look into it. But as it turns out, it's more than likely a phishing attack, which we've been working in tech for a long time. And nine times out of 10, it's not that they've managed to somehow hack their account, it's that you've given them information to your account or you've you given would. them access to your account. So we're here, we're back again. This is almost 100% certainly a phishing attack. Um, what this page we're on right now, and we're gonna skip through a couple of different pages. This is actually the account of the person who hacked um, or hacked the, who got access to those NFTs um, through a phishing link. And now I'll go back one step. A phishing link is essentially something that appears to be uh, it appears to be like a, a proper link. So they would fake what OpenSea looks like and they'll make it. So you click on there and then essentially you've given access to your wallet through approving kind of access to that system there. Um, there's more details than that, but we're not going to go into it here, but I'm just going to have a quick show you really quickly. Um, OpenSea's quickly got rid of their kind of account and put it on the blacklist. So if mm -hmm. you go to their actual account, you can see here, that's the address up the top, um, but you can't actually access that there. So but, through, Dan, how did we first find out about this? Can you... Uh, <laughs> Let's ask how do we find out about it? The beginning, yeah. Let's let's. Let, I want to show everybody that's watching, like, what do we see that first alerted us, and what? Let's go through the breadcrumbs before we get deep into it. Then we'll jump back into this stuff. Yeah, I mean, like the first alert was warnings on Discord, yep. um, and then people were saying you can revoke access or remove access from your wallet. So people were saying, hey, if you've got access to this account or this OpenSea contract, please remove access to that. Um, but people then soon realized that it wasn't the contract itself. It was literally just a connection with your wallet that you've approved that you shouldn't have approved. I'm going to make play up. So I didn't, you know, I'm not in any high level discords and I'm lying. I got it later in the discord, but, um, I actually seen that Twitter thread by John HQ that came up. Can you, do you, do you have that one mm. handy to kind of show yeah, us? Yeah, yeah. 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 So that's so, the first thing that I saw. Yeah. Yeah. And this, this is pretty, how long ago was this now? This was actually 11 AM. So a while, a while ago Sometimes now, and this is one of the first yeah. things that we saw, um, it appears the attacker is using a smart contract, um, to interact with open new exchange contracts. So they're using their own smart contracts. I'm very unsure how this is working and what's being exploited, but it appears that open new contract is absolutely rugged. Now it open new contract has not been rugged. Um, open has actually come up and said, we're actively investigating rumors of an exploit associated with open related smart contracts. This appears to be a phishing attack originating outside of OpenSea's website. And you can see those retweets going up every second. Yeah, um, do not click links outside of OpenSea. And that's the crux of it. Do not click on anything. So the contract, like we good. got that. So it's good then. So, the like, so if you upgraded to the contract, you're okay. Cause I think that's what I was freaking out at first. Cause we all got that email yeah. that said to upgrade to the new smart contract. And everybody's like, oh my God, I upgraded. I should revoke all access. So, what you're telling me right now, if it's a phishing attack, the contract's good. Is that what you're saying? That's what it appears like. And this is not financial advice. This is not smart contract advice, <laughs> whatever. Legal. Yeah. Um, if you lose all your tokens, I, I'm not in control of that. Um, <laughs> but even OpenSea said it appears like it's a phishing attack. Um, so, and this is technology, man. People will believe whatever they see in front of them. It's like when those DMs in Discord turn your DMs off. Um, they'll be clicking links that their mates send them because they think it's their mates when it's actually someone that's got access to their yeah. account. Do not click anything unless you know what it is. But I'm going to show you the stuff that you probably want to see. And that's what have they got? So I went on Looks Rare because Looks Rare hasn't deactivated their account. I'm not sure if Looks Rare can. <laughs> um, but we've got a couple of mutant apes, a board ape. We've got a baby dragon, cool cat, another board ape, clone X, um, a doodle. Like, dude, but, but you, you got to think there's, there is someone that has said, yes, allow access to my account, mm -hmm. not intentionally. And I feel, I, I feel for them, but I also know that you and I have mm -hmm. learned over the many years of being involved in technology at a large Don't corporation. <laughs> Don't click anything. You actually, what you do is you get out of that and you go to the website and find the link on the actual website itself. 100%. Hey, did that, how much is they, I've seen something like 70, 750, you did they got like, it was something, I can't remember where I saw that now at Shell, that they got like board apes uh, for crazy cheap and a bunch of other things as well. I don't know if that was Twitter or if that was well, another Discord, showed how much they paid. So 700, $750 in gas, everything yeah. was free. <laughs> 
<laughs> so you imagine that um, account value one point seven million dollars, and I'm sure there's probably more value than that in there. Um, you can see what they've got here. Seventeen Conex, cool Azuki. cats, as I said. Yeah. Uh, Seventeen Azuki, yeah. yeah. Um, but man, I'd, I'd love to find out where this link officially came from originally, or what it looks like. So, um, if you are one of the, sorry, I'm not sure why I got on that one there. Um, if you are one of the unfortunate people that did get fished, let us know. We're, we're keen to see what the kind of how obvious it was and what took you to that spot as well. Um, but yeah, we, we feel for the people that have um, got hurt a hit on this, but unfortunately, and fortunately as well, it doesn't appear like it's anything to do with open sea. Cool guys. We just wanted to bring that to you. Like we don't often have the chance to jump in and do breaking news. Like I'm surprised my kids weren't screaming in the background. Cause I'm like, damn, we got to record this right now. This is big. We want to get this out to our audience to let everybody know what's going on. Let us know in the comments. If you guys know any more information about the open sea, I'll say, I was about to say contract explore, but the open sea, potential phishing attack. Also, there's a link to the Discord below. Jump in there and let's have some chats about it to try to figure this thing out so we can share it with the rest of the community. Dan, was there any other hot news that we need to talk about before we get out of here? Now, there's, and can you share my screen once more? Um, there is a person by the name of Niso or Neso. Um, their someone has actually gone really deep into it. So if you are interested, please jump on, follow them. Um, say the guys from NFTU sent you, that would, <laughs> that would make my day. Um, but basically they go into real detail about how they potentially had the phishing attack. Um, and man, there's some really smart people out there. I sent you a DM if you ever see this message. So um, please come on the channel with us and, and, and tell us more about this because uh, you seem like you've switched on there. So thanks, buddy. Legit, guys. And until next time, it's your friendly neighborhood flood fighter, Michael T. Raglan, and your boy, Dirty Dan, who is our local reporter with all the breaking news. We'll catch you <laughs> in the next one, guys. Peace. See you, bye. All right.